had the same letter in it from the same last name. Two days later, somebody that was five foot five, 110 pounds, sits down there. And her birthday was July 11th in 1939. And her father had just gotten a business that he had built in Chicago so big in the Midwest that they had him move into the coast and cover from Bangor, Maine to Key West, Florida. And he moved in just outside of New York City where my parents moved. Uh, and uh, my mother had come from Cleveland because my father had come over, my, my grandfather had come over from Saco, went to Ohio and built that and he developed some patents and things like this and sold it to the car businesses and so on. But, she came to New York, met my father, who had come when he was 12 years old on his own because his mother didn't want him to go through the Second World War or even the First World War and go ahead and took him and sent him to New York and then he moved to the New York area. But anyway, this, this girl and I finally figured out that we were about uh, in our freshman year, you know, two years later, we said, I think we're dating. <laughs> How long were you married? What? How long were you married? Well, we got married four months short of being 21. Mm -hmm. And we're now 85 years old. Is she here? And we are, we're both alive. And she's uh, two days younger than I am. And uh, we are now married 65 years to each other. And knew each other. Well, it's be more 61 minus 21 months short of 21, and we were as, as, as 17 when we met, or younger. Maybe 16. We found out something very interesting, though. She went, when we graduated high school, she went up to college, 